everyone, my name is Aya. Today we are with Atlas and Maximum from Liquid and we're gonna be cooking some recipes from the World of Warcraft cookbook. We are also joined with special guest Lula that's gonna be teaching us everything and telling us what to do because uh, we're not cooks and we don't, really, we don't really know what we're doing, so. That is quite okay. I am here to help. I'm willing to hold your hands and make sure that we kind of try to get through this in one piece. All right, sounds good. This is Cooking with Liquid MMO. So today I'm gonna to be directing these lovely individuals into making three ingredients from the World of Warcraft cookbook. We're gonna be making the Kaldori pine bread, we're gonna be making the Dalaran brownies, and we're also going to be making the Hearthglen ambrosia today. Okay guys, we're gonna be starting out with the Kaldori pine nut bread. Are you guys ready? Yes, yep. chef. <laughs> yes, chef. Excellent, <laughs> excellent. Good to hear that, let's get started. Grab a measuring cup right over there and get me out a one and a half cups of milk, please. That's like one and a half, right? We're gonna need a teaspoon of honey in that milk. Just well, like a little bit. Your tell you? Just like a little bit. That's it, mm. <laughs> That's good, right? No, you need a little. Oh, little my bit. bad. That's not? You can mm. keep going. Okay, all right. You got this. Okay. And that's it. That's a and teaspoon. that's so much honey, but that's good. That's you, a teaspoon. It's good. We're good. Okay. All right. So I'm gonna need you to grab the instant yeast. So I need you to grab two teaspoons of yeast and stick it. Yo, in where are the teaspoons? No, no. I did one, so you know what it is. Oh, I just have yeah. to. Take so this is like this is like vibe. this is one teaspoon. Pr pristine vibe. You go more. Exactly mm -hmm. one. That's one. Okay. Yeah. And this is two. Gabagoo. All right, so uh, with that, I'm gonna have you guys mix it together. It's looking pretty activated. Yeah. Beastie. It's looking swirled. Yeah. Make sure you guys have all of that in there, nice and taken care of. Yeah. Because when yeah. you're done, we're gonna have to add some olive oil and an egg. Well, oh, you're practice. doing the egg though. So we're gonna need 14. <laughs> okay. I mean, perfect. That was so smooth. That was, that was actually kind of cool. <laughs> Dude, Enjoy what the hell? Plant. Olive oil, get with the program. <laughs> All right, we need uh, four tablespoons of olive oil in there. That's a lot of olive oil, actually. That was a clean crack, I promise I'm not you gonna it's lie. gonna be. <laughs> I think the there. yolk is still... Yeah. You gotta break it. Yeah, All right, I, I can I, get I, it. I broke it. There you go. Oh my god. Oh. I going in with the... Uh, <laughs> that is so extreme. Okay, Murder. I don't feel safe. <laughs> Here, one second. You Wait, keep, we have knives on You set. keep stirring this while I add the tablespoons of olive oil. Not for hey. you. Ah. Oh. I gotta add this. Keep on stirring. I'm it's looking. It's tablespoons, isn't it? it? Yeah, it's tablespoons. Yeah. Going oh, in yeah. For, for get it. How many? Just get it. Four. Like, I'm keeping track of this, too. So yeah. Right. That's good. I don't know how you track tablespoons with your eyeballs, but I'm here for it. This is gonna be the most scuffed yep. bread ever. You're there we good. go. Excellent. That's it. That's it. Where's the faith? Excellent. All righty. So I'm gonna have you grab that big bowl over there, that big empty bowl. That's me. And we're gonna go ahead and add our liquid right into that bowl. Oh yeah, pour it right in there. Mm. All in there. Go ahead and grab four cups of flour. And that's what this is. Yes. Hold it. Okay. <laughs> Absolutely. Go in there, make sure it's all nice and level. Keep. He did not do that. It was not level. Huh? That's good. We're all about oh, eyeball. Look, look at it's that. It's fine. It's fine. Look at that. That's totally fine. Yeah, yeah there you go. That's, that's Oh yeah, that definitely right made it much better than what I was going <laughs> to do. So am I supposed to still be swelling this? No, bro, get the... Whip it. Just give it slow, nice slow stirs. Yeah, there you go. Just kind of give give yourself a little bit of like oof going into that bread. Four cups, correct? Yes. Okay, fourth cup. Mm. Keep it stirring. What else? Mm. What's next? Alrighty, so you're gonna make sure all that liquid's gonna be absorbed into the flour because as soon as it turns into some kind of a dough looking thing, you're gonna put it right on the table and start kneading it out. With your hands? With your hands. So who's volunteering to put their hands I, uh, in there? I volunteered to do that. Sounds good. <laughs> I don't sleep, so it makes sense. Yep. Good. You might need goggles for that. It can get wild oh, yeah. now that it's activated. Oh, yeah. Now that it's activated, it. you'll need these. Right. So and now am I stirring it with my Yeah, you're gonna go in it. with your hands. You're Make sure nice that massage. the uh, flour is absorbing into the oh, look liquid. At what? I think wow. we're gonna need a little bit more flour though. Can you sprinkle in that some is flour for me? I can. Meeting. You want a little sprinkle? Yeah, just gonna go in. Oh, salt it. Yeah, yeah. Uh, okay. There you go. Oh yeah. Yeah, there it is. <laughs> so if you want when she's stirring it in, I need you to put in some uh, Italian seasoning for me, please. Oh. Ah, that's this chocolate. No, 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 it's the right? thing labeled okay. Italian seasoning. Yep. <laughs> yes, it is. I'm gonna need yeah. one and a half uh, teaspoons, please, to go right in. One and she a said half. get in there. I heard one. Get it. That's that's in there. He's if in. That's what you want to do. Yeah. We're yes. with our heart today. Like I'm, doing it I'm right. very Italian. I'm not Italian at all. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> so we're also going to need uh, a we half make it the bread. Of Parmesan cheese. 
We're going a little uh, sleek, suave, and sexy here with the uh, Parmesan pouring. Yeah, you gotta be gentle with it. Yeah. It's, it's about sex appeal. The, the bread. What's up? <laughs> just keep going, man. Don't stop with the hands, keep going. Oh, sorry. <laughs> I was just trying to be nice. So we're trying to knead the dough, don't let it uh, tear or rip, or we're trying to make it turn into a dough, okay. <laughs> Looks like it's ready to go on the table, let's go. Wait, oh, I don't, what I, am I doing? There's a bunch of stuff <laughs> I just not threw mixed this in, in there. there. Uh. All right, put it on the table, we'll fix it. <laughs> oh, oh, <laughs> sorry. no, gentle. I'm sorry. Oh, I see what you mean. Okay, it's let's like, get that in there too. It's loose, yeah, get it in there. Okay. Yeah, get that Parmesan. Is this where you do the like master chef? Uh, that's for pizza. But whoa, 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 whoa! Oh, oh, can I? Uh, maybe not, but but also maybe. All right, guys, I'm gonna need you to add some pine nuts into that dough. So go ahead and uh, just shove work your it nuts in. in there. Just keep working no, shove it your in. Nuts you in gotta there. work it in. No, shove your nuts in there. Oh, okay. Come on, get it in there, man. <laughs> yeah. Okay. How go. gentle? Yeah, put put all of your nuts in there. How gentle indeed. <laughs> just go right in there and just work it in. Oh no! Well, okay, maybe a little too rough there. Alrighty, so what we're gonna do right at the moment is we're gonna go ahead and uh, put this in a bowl, cover it with some plastic wrap so that we can let that proof for a while, so we can let the yeast do its thing. While the bread is proofing, we're gonna go ahead and get started on making the Dalaran brownies next. So are you guys ready? Yes, Chef! Yep! yep. <laughs> That is great to hear. Pass me that butter. So we're gonna melt about a third of a cup, I'm sorry, we're gonna melt a half of a cup of butter into this pan right here. Oh, oh perfect. We're also going to need a third of a cup of cocoa powder if you wanna measure that out for me, Max. There it is. So the next thing we're gonna need is we're gonna need three quarters of a cup of sugar. So give me the quarter cup three times. Alrighty, so. Everything's all melted out. We're gonna turn off the heat and let it all come together. <clears throat> let me give you a whisk to make your life a little easier there, girl. We're just trying to make sure everything all comes together so that it uh, turns into the base that we need. Is it like hot hot? Is it like super warm? Uh, do you wanna touch it? No. <laughs> Atlas with the intensity, I love it. Yes, chef. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and need to crack the two eggs that are gonna go into this batter. No, 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 no. Oh, okay. I thought you were gonna do the double. Wait, is this hot? Where do are it. you putting this? Uh, put it down. So, Wait, so are we doing the Atlas method? Do it. Okay. You ready? Ready? Yeah. And three, two, one. Oh my gosh. Woo! Look at that, you guys. Excellent job. That was great. That's that's easier than it seems. Is there like no, a- No, it's very hard. Is there like a You're paper towel good. for my forehead? You're good. Here you go. <laughs> Yeah, a little, <laughs> I got a little on there. Oh, this looks nice. It look good. Oh yeah, it's smells nice good too. Like we're gonna start putting some dry ingredients in there. What's the next dry ingredient to prepare, Chef? We're gonna be putting in half a cup of all-purpose flour. We're gonna be putting in a quarter teaspoon of salt. And then we're gonna be putting in a quarter teaspoon of baking powder as well. So yeah. a tiny bit more sprinkle. It's tiny, okay. Wow. Yes. Is that enough? There it is. Mm. Once it's all nice and put together, don't forget to squeegee the sides. That's why I gave you a nice squeegee spatula. Once we are done squeegeeing that, we're actually gonna pour that into a nice pan to bake into the oven. There it is. Oh, that looks good. Yeah, so that is that our brownie batter. I did that. So once you have your sheet pan nice and smoothed out, go ahead and make sure you take this brownie batter into the oven at a 350 degrees for about 20 to 25 minutes, depending on your oven. Make sure you read the directions and make sure you uh, check on your pan frequently. Now that we're done with the Dalaran brownie recipe, we're gonna go ahead and move on to finishing up that Caldorite pine nut bread. We're gonna see how good these three can shape some dough out here and uh, make some pretty shapes. So now that we have this nice big and puffy dough ball, we're gonna go ahead and punch it down, divide it into three sections, and let these beautiful assistants here make some pretty, pretty leaves. Are you guys ready? Yes, yes chef. chef. All right, awesome. Yeah. All right, okay. now, there it is. <laughs> no, not that hard, that's too hard, that's too yeah, hard. Also, keep it on the thing here. Sorry. Dough needs some love there, maybe that's a little too much punching, but you, you get the idea. Just, you know, kiss it, Poor say you're sorry. Poor little guy, I'm sorry. He's a little buff pack. Yeah. There it is. And then I cut it into breaks. three <laughs> dough loaves. And then each of you just pick a piece. Okay. And so what I'm gonna have you guys do, so we're looking at something similar oh. to this. That's, uh, that's interesting. <laughs> ah, okay. Dude, it looks like shit. 
<laughs> oh my god! And this is it though, this is a good leaf. You, you're the only one that did it right. <laughs> of course. It looks yeah. like it looks like a Naru, like actually. That's end. what I was going for. Oh my god. Oh, Atlas has a Naru bread. I'm impressed. You guys are getting shown up by Atlas and that's that's a little embarrassing. What what? <laughs> what the hell, chef? <laughs> that you're doing great right oh, now. Oh, Just oh, hurt thank his you, feelings. Thank you, thank you. How do I get this? Oh, I have to get it there, huh? Yes, sir. Yeah, I need that's, help. That's tag how team, that happened, tag team, by the way. Tag team, tag team, right, get in there. You can't work. call tag team. Tag team. He's a hero. I, tag team. I had to do mine on tag my own. Tag team. Oh. There you go. Oh, yeah. Excellent. I think that looks great. I don't know if Me you guys too. see the Naru shape, the but it is, it is quite impressive in there. It does look like a Naru. And I have to say, it's one of the uh, better bread shapes I've ever seen here. So we're going to go ahead and let this proof out for 15 minutes. Once it's done proofing, it's gonna get a nice egg glaze on top and we're gonna go ahead and throw it in the oven for four, at 400 degrees for about 25 to 30 minutes, depending on your oven. While our Calderai pine nut bread is going, we're gonna go ahead and get started on making the end of the day drink and that is going to be the Hearth Blend Ambrosia. All right, so I need somebody to cut up a pear for me. Shout out to all the pear. Shout out, yeah. yeah. We're gonna core the pear. Yeah. We're gonna go ahead and take the- I don't think I've ever cut a pear in my life. Good pear bits and we're gonna cut into like little pieces that are gonna go in here. So we're gonna let her get to work while we put together Wait. everything else. So I'm gonna need you to use this saucepan for me, Max, and measure out half a cup of sugar. Okay, half cup of sugar. Two tea bags. So we have the sugar, put the tea bags right in there. Yep. Go for it. It's a wonderful job. So go ahead and measure out for me one cup of water that's gonna go right into the can as well, please. There is no shot you're using that for the water. <laughs> there it goes, go ahead right into the saucepan. All right, so we're gonna need a cinnamon stick in there too and half a teaspoon of the ground cardamom. Half a teaspoon, that's like two and a half pinches. Well, that's like, yeah, two and a half, three pinches. So once uh, that's all put together, we're gonna stir it up. So now that the pears are done, let's go ahead and put that in the saucepan as well. And let's go ahead and get this on the stove. So we're gonna let that simmer for about a couple of minutes. I do believe the book says 10. All right, awesome. Now that we have had our pot of ambrosia going for about 10 minutes, so we're gonna go ahead and shut this off. We're gonna give it a second to steep. So while this is steeping, I'm gonna need you to measure out some, uh, some stuff for me. We're gonna go ahead and take the gin in those two glasses right there, and we're gonna need a half a cup of gin and a quarter cup of maple syrup. And we're gonna go ahead and put it right into our measuring cup. Go ahead and put it down. Oh, that looks good. It does look good. It smells good. Oh, yeah. Excellent. Perfect. So now we have, preferably suggestively served warm, our parsley ambrosia. Oh, be careful. There it is. <laughs> goes a long way. Excellent. Look at that, you guys. All righty. Wow. I'm very proud of you guys. You did such a good job today. Cheers. Cheers, you guys. Cheers. Yeah. Woo. Excellent day today on the cooking front. Love it. Cheers again. All right, guys. Now that we have finished doing all the work, we're ready to enjoy the fruits of our labor. Are you guys ready to test out uh, what you guys made? Yes, chef. Yes, chef. All right, cool. Well, the cooking is over. You guys can relax. It is time to just eat. So here is the results. Our Calderai pine nut bread. Get in there and just uh, rip out some pieces. Yes, give me oh a piece God. of that bread. Mm. Okay. Mm. Just production one time. Mm-hmm. Mm. <laughs> that, that is not what you want, is it? So what did you guys think of the bread? Wonderful, Good. nutty. Nutty. Nailed it. Yeah. Nice, all right, so how about you guys wash that down with some of the uh, Hearth Blend Ambrosia? Tell me what you guys think. Okay. Oh, it's wonderful. Oh, that's yeah. That's yeah. good. Yeah. That's that's got nice it's got, some, it's got that cinnamon from the racetrack. Mm -hmm. You guys are yep. like super surprised that it's yeah. good. Because <laughs> you not. guys made it yourselves. I don't I'm know. not. He's I'm not. not. Yeah. yeah. Now, time for dessert. We're going to test it out right here. So I'll, I'll go ahead and leave these out for you guys to try nice. out. I'll have both. Does production want one? <laughs> <laughs> Throw it at the camera again. So go ahead and uh, grab a piece. Oh, wait. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. That was very sensual. Mm -hmm. We're so good at cooking. We're yeah. just so good. I'm very proud of you guys. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. This is actually so good. No, this is, you guys deserve really some applause. You guys turned out with some really good food. I think a lot of it was in the like eyeballing. Mm -hmm. I think so. I think you guys eyeballed really, really well. Turned yep. out with some uh, really good recipes. So 
I'm really happy with the way everything turned out. I hope you guys are too. Mm -hmm. Yes, chef. Mm -hmm. Yes, chef. Thank you so much for watching. We had so much fun cooking these recipes from the World of Warcraft cookbook. I thought we did a lot better than maybe we thought we were gonna do. Thank you so much, Lula, for helping us with that. Uh, is there anything you wanna shout out to? Don't forget to check out the morning show that's gonna be broadcasting during the Race to World first. I will be there. Make sure you guys are there nice and early. You can also find me at twitch.tv slash lulaboo if you also wanna see my cooking shows whenever there is no race. Thank you so much for watching. Make sure you check out the rest of our videos here on YouTube at Liquid MMO.